finally we are out. Chamberlains, high priests, buffoons, architects, courtesans. <laughs> How are you? How are you? You're fine? Which song is that? invaded the fields, and marshes dried up on the river's bank. And so, to save his life, man invented civilization. He had to contend with floods, designed dams and culverts. He came to be loved of earth and wanted for his grave. But soon he wished to outlive. Saw the progress of dynasties and grave priests and the light steps of noble ladies whose diaphanous veils seem to clothe them, yet not to touch them. Who is going to the mountain? Of course I. Ay -ay. Ay -ay. Oh, Ay -ay. hey, even Jaja. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Kakati, um, we are planning to go early. I don't know if everybody is okay, if you want to eat fast, or the stomach is okay. Okay, now it's not dinner time, that's the issue. And if we are to wait for dinner, dinner has to be served, what time, Farouk? Seven o'clock. That will be very late for you to start climbing the mountain. The earlier you go, when it's still bright enough, during sunset, it's okay. But when you go late, you might arrive up the peak of the mountain, like maybe midnight or after midnight. <laughs> yeah, so it depends on how fast you're going to go. And uh, I don't advise people to follow some people because some people, <laughs> their speed might be. You might stop on the way when you're following others. Go by your own pace. I'm speaking out of experience. Me, I've gone to that mountain my first time. I came back the next day at 10. <laughs> so I, I'm speaking out of experience. So when you are going, especially those with the loved ones, please, this mountain, Ogenda Weka. <laughs> so don't think that going with your, your, your wife or your girlfriend is going to save you. <laughs> so now we, we are trying to have a plan that when you come back, because it's not dinner time right now at the hotel, uh, so we, we go, when you come back you'll find some tea and bread. But along the mountain, you will take some tea. I don't encourage you to take water because the more water you take, you get tired. 
The only thing you need is sugar when you are climbing the mountain. You need more energy, so it is sugar that gives you energy. <laughs> yes. You'll see the mountain. That's not the mountain. Yeah. You'll see it. But if I fail to come back, you cannot fail. Ah, for you came back next day. Not I came back. You will also come back. Yeah. yeah. So I just. Twenty yeah. onge la yo. No one. to find here is what is here this is the I, I, I know it's even better than what we have at home in some villages yeah. so let us bear with what is there I know it's moderate enough for all of us for our comfort but because of the area we are in this is the best of the best that we can get here so we are going to get out we are going to get our t-shirts they are walking sticks at the reception uh, those who want more coverings or more warm clothing it's right there at the reception, there are shops there. Uh, Moses' shop is the best, I can tell you. Uh, so, let us just go get ready quickly and go to the mountain. If you arrive there and you look at the mountain, and you feel, ah, uh -huh, don't go. But I encourage everyone to go, it's a very good experience. And besides anything else, so wherever it is, whether you're Muslim or Christian, all of you can go there, your prayers will be heard. Now this is the other part of it, that Saba, and God answers those prayers. It's a special mountain, it's the only mountain where God appeared. If I feel like, ah, can they bring me back? By the way, now this is serious. If you go up the mountain and you fail to go up, the only thing you're going to do, they will get you a place where to sit until your colleagues come back. So there are rest stops there, so you only have to sit there until they... So, Mamami and Daga, then come out. Moses Oh. So Moses was listening to God when Moses was there. Yeah. So let me let me see how Moses was listening to God. So I want to have a lunch. And keep another more. Moses, you are no. Four days. According to Ngaba Nyonyode, Moses, you are no. Mumpukwe no. What? Ngaba Uliriza Katonda Mateke Kumi. We are going to see we got So. I have a balloon to be just a fine program. Fetuliko Moses one way. I didn't know. I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Okay. Of Mountain Sanai. Walked and worked, surveyors, geometers, astronomers to whom no star was unknown, engineers, architects, a whole people, while the rest of the world hunted wild beasts and sheltered in caves. You look nice. But this is nice. This is 
Yo, I'm Kim Sido, the cute boy. Against death. 465 He achieved the building of the highest monument then known to man. The area it covers is vast enough to hold St. Peter's Cathedral in Rome, the cathedrals of Florence and Milan. Three million blocks of stone, some of them weighing 30 tons, were assembled by Kiot's faithful workmen to achieve this fabulous construction. At the center of it, the pharaoh planned his inner chamber, where his mummy was to lie in splendor for eternity. At the foot of this pyramid, one way to two say, to two say, uh, to square safari, one way to two, to fugida, a piece of pitchy, or what you know, the Twitter, quad bike riding, quad bike riding, or runs of Guanay, a kind of to get a rule, Jenyo, a chicken to get a cob, reject a movie about the new flower, and to have in total, a lot of guy, a piece of pitchy. Showing a noble face, the nose aquiline, the jaw determined, and the hieroglyphs. Representing the name he gave to his pyramid, Cheops dominates the horizon. <laughs> city in the plain which joined Upper and Lower Egypt. Great and powerful were the pharaohs who on this side of the Nile built for eternity. Its aim accomplished, the fourth dynasty collapsed. 